Melatonin is a hormone that helps regulate sleep and produces antioxidants for the body. Melatonin is called the hormone of darkness because the amount of melatonin that is produced increases when it is dark outside and decreases when the sun is out and that's why people sleep at night. Some of the environmental effects on melatonin are seasonal affective disorder, also known as SAD, and jet lag. SAD is a branch of depression and mostly affects people who live in the northern areas of the world because they receive very little sunlight. Areas such as Canada, Scandinavia, and Russia, which results in an overproduction of melatonin. Some of the psychological effects of seasonal affective disorder are low self-esteem, sleep problems, irritability, lack of enthusiasm, and lack of energy. A study done by Charmaine Eastman, the director of the Biological Rhythms Research Laboratory at Chicago's Rush University Medical Center, and her colleagues took four weeks, and they studied how specific bright lights also known as phototherapy, affected people with SAD at different times of the day. They had 96 patients sit in front of these special bright lights, some in front of them in the morning, some at night, and some in front of some deactivated negative ion generators in a placebo effect. The results showed that people who sat in front of the lights in the morning almost went into complete mirror remission, more so than the placebo group and the patients who sat in front of the lights at night. For people who suffer from SAD are now prescribed to sit in front of the light every day to help recover from their symptoms. Another environmental effect is jet lag. Jet lag occurs when a person crosses multiple time zones and their internal clock or their circadian rhythm becomes out of sync. A person with jet lag can become irritable, impatient, fatigued, get headaches, and insomnia, among many other symptoms. Researchers at the Max Planck Institute for Biophysical Chemistry turned off their adrenal clock in mice after they found that it was linked to the body's psychological process, and once it was turned off, it was no longer synchronized. After the clock is turned off, the mice were able to adapt more quickly to the time change without as many symptoms. The study greatly helped scientists who are trying to make a hormone that will help decrease the effects of jet lag in humans. There are not many treatments for jet lag because it usually wears off and is not that serious. The treatments that are available, however, are melatonin supplements that can be taken to help your body adjust na more naturally to the time zone, or you can take sleeping pills. Melatonin has many effects on our psychological processes when there is a disturbance in the amount of sun or sleep that we get, such as a seasonal affective disorder and jet lag. Although both have to do with melatonin, it seems that researchers should be more concerned with more serious disorders such as SAD instead of making cures for less serious issues such as jet lag.